Saturday, there will be a free self-defense class for women. This comes as a Five News viewer is following up to our coverage of the NWA Women's Shelter seeking funds to stay open with an event to raise donations. Five News reporter Esther Castro joins us live with those details. Good morning. Yeah, hey April, good morning. We're here at Bentonville Krav Maga with the owner, Russ Keeler. Thanks for joining us out here. We appreciate it. Yes, we're glad to have been here uh, all morning uh, doing some uh, fun stuff and uh, got the whole group out here today. So, well, not the whole group, but got some of the diehards that came in to work with us. Uh, as we know, this is for the benefit for the uh, women's shelter. We will have our class tomorrow. The uh, women will be learning some awesome techniques. We'll be uh, spending from 9 to 12, teaching them in, in an in a orderly fashion so that they leave there feeling confident in what they're learning. Uh, awesome. One of the, one of the uh, techniques we'll be working on, if I can get my lead instructor, L to join us, uh, will be a hair pull from the front. You ready, Elle? All right, and she's got him on the ground. That's it. So women can learn these very important techniques tomorrow. Um, and not only is it giving you physical skills, but also self-confidence, right? It's building that self-confidence back up to know, I can take you down physically and mentally, correct? Yes, we did that earlier. You got to try it out and uh, see how it works, and uh, you really enjoyed it. Uh, anything you want to add, Elle? Yeah, it's a, it's a great opportunity, and even if you're not uh, a big proponent of fighting or you don't, you'll ever need self-defense, you still need to come out and learn because you you don't know that you're not going to need it at some point. And so we really encourage everyone to come out, whether you really feel like it or not. <laughs> all right, yeah, thank you so much, you guys. Uh, all the proceeds tomorrow go towards the women's 100%. shelter. 100%. 100% of the proceeds go. It's from 9 to 12 tomorrow. Um, and like I said, not only do you get physical skills, but you also get the confidence to know that you can take down um, an abuser that is coming towards you at, at any time um, and like I said earlier 17% of the Northwest Arkansas shelters money comes from the government 20% comes from their thrift store and then the rest comes from the community citizens like you Russ so thank you for giving back to the shelter we appreciate it we enjoy it we uh, we appreciate even being able to do this and once again it is free if you can donate we really would like you to if you can't still come and enjoy it Great, thank you so much. A very serious issue that we definitely uh, do not take lightly here, as we can see behind us. So yes. thank you so much. Uh, great, we're live here in Bentonville covering the news where you live. April, we'll send it back to you. All right, thank you, Esther.